Hi everyone, I'm James and welcome to another episode of James or Something. Now it's been a while since I've done one of these. Um, I know in the first one I didn't leave the best review of the delivery because COVID was going on. I want to change my review now. Um, since everything's gone on with COVID and we've progressed through it, progressing through it, um, they've actually been a lot better. So I went onto the website, uh, delivery took to freeze five days instead of the like month I was waiting last time. So it's a lot better now, um, constant emails, from, well not constant, but emails from Royal Mail, uh, delivery, dispatch, all that. So very happy with it now. You can go also go onto the website to check the progress of the order, so that's good. Uh, a lot better than the first time, but anyway, so we're going to get into this. So I have another cocktail man. We've got another cocktail box here that we're going to be opening and reviewing. So we're going to get this open now then, and we're going to make it, see how it goes. So... Okay, there we go. So we've got another recipe to add to the collection. We're going to be making a lemon and elder Collins. It is absolute citron vodka, a dehydrated lemon, and the cocktail's man lemon and elder flower liqueur, which I must say is in a very, very nice bo uh, bottle. So I'm just going to show you the bottle. So if you look at that. That's what the bottle looks like. Very, very nice bottle. And this is Cocktail Man's own. So this is, as far as I'm aware, this isn't another company that's made this. This is just Cocktail Man. So they've got it in a nicely presented box with everything we need. Can't really show you much closer than that, but you get the general idea. So, as always then, I'm going to make him a strong alcohol. So, um, I don't really know how much 35 milliliters of citron. So the absolute citron. Uh, the lemon elder flower and also lemon juice. I don't have lemon juice, so we're just going to be free about it. But yeah, anyway, so, as always, so that. as always, we've got our cocktail shaker here. So it says we need 35 milliliters of absolute citron, and these are the tiny little bottles that go 50 milliliters. So for about half of this. So the other one and other ones I've made, I made some more that didn't record well, but anyway. Oh, I love the smell of vodka. Mm. Anyway, so I did make some more and I realised the mistake. I just poured everything in. It said pour it all in, but I didn't, I thought I had too much to heart. So anyway, so we're just going to pour about half of this in. Yeah, about half. And then it wants 20, uh, it wants, <laughs> it wants 25 millilitres of this. Now, let's see, it, oh, that's not going to work, is it? Right, this is 100 millilitres. So we need to do about, well, way less than half then. Mmm. Uh, mmm. I can't describe the smell. It's a very pleasant smell, don't get me wrong, but let's just try and pour a bit of this in. So probably about, yeah, less than half, way less than half. Okay, so this is the first time I'm doing it this way. Um, so it says, place all the ingredients into the cocktail shaker and then shake for 10 seconds. So we've only got the little, I don't know if I'm doing this right, I really need to see that sounds nothing in there. Oh shit on it. Lesson one, do not let your vodka out. Oh, mmm, mmm. Okay, so sorry about that. We had a little spillage, but I've got it all secured now, I hope. So let's shake it up again. It wants it going for 10 seconds. So me chatting shout was about five. So two, one, there you go. So then once shaken straight into a high glass. Okay, so we've got our glass here. It's similar to what the picture shows and we want some ice in here, which I've prepared on the side here. So we're just going to get like three ice cubes, there we go, then we are going to strain, can explode a little bit, yeah I've just realised the issue with this because if I did the measurements, only goes to about there. So I've not fully figured this thing out yet but anyway I'm going to try it and we'll see what we think from my actual reaction before when I've tasted that. It's not gonna go well, but there is meant to be lime juice. Let me see if we've got any lime juice. Okay, so not got any lime juice, but as we have on this channel, we're gonna drink this raw. So, cheers. Mm. 
hmm, it's quite hard hitting at first, but then once it sort of starts going down your throat, it's actually quite smooth. Hmm, it's not just that bad, that. Oh my God, I'm an idiot. Oh no, sorry, I've been trying to find something to do measurements on. I thought this had measurements, but it doesn't. Yeah, that is quite strong. I'm not gonna lie, that is really strong. Um, but yeah, it's quite nice. Let me just go and find if anyone's available. Okay, so I've got my mother to taste test this then, so I'm just gonna warn you. It's um, Citroen Absolute Vodka, and it is, I can't remember, lemon and elderflower liqueur. Isn't it? Well, usually they say put everything in, so I just whack it all in, in one, which is why I usually get knocked off my ass on them. Very nice. Hmm, there you go, it's nice. Yeah, that's nice. Very good then. Okay, so to finish it off, I've decided to put all of it into the cocktail shaker, and because either me or someone will finish it off later, so this is all one, so obviously we'll. Uh, Make sure it stays on nice and firm, otherwise it's going to go everywhere again. It's about 10 seconds, yeah? Good enough. Right, okay. So that's all done. Still a bit left in there. I'm just going to put some more. I, I'm just going to decorate it so you can see what it's meant to look like. When it looks nice and pretty. I will also put this on, I've also put a bit of picture of it on my Instagram. So if you go over to James or something on Instagram, it'll be there. Little plug. So... There we go. Okay, so we're just gonna get the, the flour then. Sorry, not the flour, the lemon. Yeah, it's a dehydrated lemon. Lovely. <laughs> so let me just bring it over to the camera so you can see what it looks like. So this is the drink all together there's little flowers on the top like i said you can't really see it here but um i'll get the picture that i'll take in a minute that's going to go on my instagram i'll get it and put it in the video here but so anyway so this was the lemon and elder collins like i said at the beginning of the video um when lockdown got sort of loosened and we were and cocktail man started going again not going again, they were always going, but since they sorted out the delivery, they got investments and everything, the delivery was outstanding. Um, the drinks have always been incredible, like I've got the ones I've got over there, Scarlet Letter, a few others. But this, right, let's try it when it's full strength. Oh. Mm. Ah, that's strong. <laughs> but yeah, so um, I think it's got a real bad, a real kick at the beginning. And when it's going down, it's very smooth. However, my mum, when she tried it, she said it were, it's like pop. How it's very, it tastes like pop when you drink it. And when it goes down, you feel it, which is all fair, so I can't feel the burn now. But yeah, she said it's got more of a burn going down where I think it's more smooth. But anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching the video. Um, welcome back to the return of the Cocktail Man uh, boxes. I really hope you have enjoyed this video. If you didn't enjoy this video, remember to hit the like button, subscribe to my channel to see to keep up to date with everything that I'm doing. I'm gonna be doing more of these. I've got a subscription all the way to Christmas, I think. So I'll be doing them all the way, at least up till then, once a month. Um, I've got other videos coming up. Um, where I live though, we've just gone back into lockdown. So some videos have been canceled. Uh, but yeah, I do hope to enjoy in bring you guys more content very soon. And I will see you in the next one. See you later guys.